Hello and welcome. My name is Vicky Marie and I'm going to take you through a brief flow for when you really don't feel like doing yoga. This flow can take place on your bed. You can flow on the floor if that's more comfortable for you. But again, just taking this practice in your own pace, own rhythm. So when you're ready, we'll just begin to come to your easy seated position. Just ensuring the sit bones are comfortable. And just beginning to connect with the breath, lengthening the spine. We're going to begin to invite our left ear towards the left shoulder. As I face you, I'm aspiring to mirror you. And slowly letting the chin come down towards the chest. And then we'll begin to invite that right ear towards the right shoulder. Eyes can be soft or closed. And again, releasing the chin down towards the chest. Slowly begin to take the hands to the knees of the thighs. Take some seated cat-cows, tucking the chin in towards the chest, rounding the spine. And inhaling, beginning to roll forward. And just moving between these two poses in your own rhythm. Exhaling if you're using our breath to come into cat. Inhaling for cow. From our seated cat cow, we're going to begin to spiral the chest. Noticing any areas of stickiness or hesitation. And when ready, we'll begin to take our left hand down by our side. And just beginning to take that right hand to the thigh, spiraling open the chest. And we're going to take that right hand up overhead. Let's take a bit of a side stretch. Now keeping the left hand where it is, we're going to tap the right fingertips down and just making some half circles, keeping the left hand in contact with the mat. Right arm going up and then over. And you might stretch a little bit further with each round. And slowly coming to stillness, right arm up overhead. Exhaling, waiting to release that right hand down. We'll repeat this on the other side. So left hand coming to the thigh. Then we're going up and over. We'll take those half circles, releasing the left fingertips, going down and up. Again, maybe going a little bit further forward if you've got space or the inclination. And then we'll come back to that side stretch. And releasing the left hand down. We're going to ease into a twist, left hand coming to that right shin near thigh. As you begin to exhale, gently releasing the twist, you're going to come into a gentle forward fold. So sliding or walking the hands away as you tuck the chin in towards the chest, bowing down.
sliding or walking the hands back towards our lap, but we'll take that twist on the opposite side. Exhaling, beginning to release, coming back into your forward fold. Maybe this time we begin to take the palms up towards the sky, letting the back of the hands come to the surface. Palms coming back down, beginning to lift the torso up. We'll begin to take our right leg out to the side, so the left foot coming in towards the thigh. We're just going to begin to walk the hands forward. So you might stay right here up on the palms, you might come onto the forearms, you might slide a little bit further. Setting some gentle movement, shifting the weight from one hand or forearm. And then slowly lifting the torso up. And we'll begin to take the torso over that right thigh. We're going to slowly fold down. And this might be a passive fold, hands in contact with the surface, or you might grab hold of the foot, just depending on how you're feeling. Inhaling and lifting, and we'll take a twist to finish this side off. And slowly coming back to center. We're going to begin to invite that left leg out, slowly bending that right knee in. And again, you might be on the palms of the forearms, just sliding forward. Inhaling, lifting, and beginning to spiral that chest over the left leg, again being passive as we fold. With every exhale getting a little bit softer. And lifting the gaze, and we'll finish with a twist. Beginning to come back to center. And just come back to that easy seat. Hands to the knees or the thighs. And we'll finish with a spiral. And we're going a little bit deeper, a grand with the spine. And then coming back, taking the hands to the heart and gently bowing the head to the hands in gratitude for investing in your well-being and your practice. Thank you for taking this brief yoga flow with me. If you liked this video, hit like, hit subscribe, and I'll see you again soon.